It is the new home of the Los Angeles Clippers. We're counting down to the opening of Intuit Dome. We're about six months away from it actually opening, but KTLA 5's Eric Spillman is getting an inside look at the progress that's being made along with a very, very big announcement. Eric, good morning to you. It's huge. Good morning. I told you about this last hour. It's a major announcement from the LA Clippers. We are standing here in the Intuit Dome, which will be ready for the Clippers next season. Construction taking place here. Everybody's got a hard hat. I've got one too. That's the way it goes here. It's a beautiful place. More about that in just a second though. But first, the big reveal. The Clippers have an entirely new look, a new logo. And we want to show it to you. Here is the rebranding of the Los Angeles Clippers. So the new logo for the Clippers has a naval ship on it. A Clipper is, after all, a sailing ship. It also has a sea on it and a compass. But the ship is the centerpiece, goes back to the origin of the Clippers, back to when they used to play in San Diego. It's their nautical heritage, pays homage to their nautical heritage. The emphasis is on navy blue. This is a logo you're going to see on center court when the Intuit Dome opens. And it's not just the logo that's changing. The team's going to have new uniforms as well beginning next season. Red, white, and navy blue versions. More on that coming up next hour. All right. So why rebrand the team? Well, let me tell you why. Clippers owner and chief cheerleader Steve Ballmer did some research. He did some focus groups with Clippers fans. One question was, should they change the name of the team? Well, they actually thought about it. But the fans were completely against that idea. That's what the research showed. Ballmer, however, wanted a whole new look, and so they chose something bold to show that the Clippers are moving in a new direction. That's what the logo is all about. All right, new look in a new home, a new dome. And let's give you a progress report on what's happening here, the Intuit Dome. Everything is on schedule. This is how it looks from the air. You've seen it maybe possibly on a recent flight into LAX. It's coming together well. The Dome will open for concerts in August. Usher's going to play here. Billy Joel's going to play here. And then the Clippers will play their first NBA game here in October. All kinds of unique design features here. We're going to be talking about that all morning long. Come back to our live picture. One of the design features is the giant halo dome, a halo board, I should say, at the top of the dome. The, the roof of this place was actually designed for this thing. It's huge, and they just finished it the other day. It's really incredible. Amazing to show you the progress. Lots of construction workers here. They're coming to work this morning. There's 7,000 of them, and they are very proud of the work that they've done here and proud to display it when it is going to be seen on TV in the next few months. All right, next hour, I'm going to be driving this forklift here and also doing some arc welding as well, show off my construction skills. Actually, no, I don't want to do that, but we will be interviewing the uh, president of business operations for the Clippers here coming up with all kinds of surprises for you all morning long. We'll send it back to you.